Hello, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Got a really amazing opportunity in front of me this weekend. I am here in Le Mans, France, at the 24-hour of Le Mans weekend. Now, as you know, I have never raced in the 24-hour of Le Mans before. It has been my life stream to do so. Still not doing it. However, I am racing this weekend in the Road to Le Mans, which is a support race for the 24-hour. It's the first year that the ACO is allowing a support race of this nature. GT3, GT cars are allowed to race, and also LMP3 machinery. And I have landed myself a seat with United Autosports, the leading team in the European Le Mans series. They're currently leading the LMP3 championship. They've won a number of races so far. They are the team to beat. And I am a lucky guy, <laughs> get it, guy? And I get to drive with these guys this weekend. And teamed up even better with my good friend, Mike Headland. Now in this series, it is uh, technically a gentleman series. It's a pro-am format, and it is mandatory that you have one silver ranked driver and one bronze ranked driver. I am ranked silver, uh, Mike Hedlund is ranked bronze, and I have to tell you, of all the guys out there that are ranked bronze under the uh, FIA driver rating list, Mike Hedlund is one of the fastest guys. He's a newcomer to racing as of within the past five years. He is probably the most hardworking, dedicated driver I have ever met. He's a great guy, we're good friends, and it's awesome we get to have this opportunity together. So I am personally stoked. As far as the LMP3 car, it's like a baby LMP2 car. It's uh, very, almost probably the exact tub, uh, carbon fiber monocoque as the LMP2 cars, full FIA crash safety tested and uh, really, really safe, uh, really safe car. A little bit less downforce, less power, a little bit smaller in size, but as you can see, it is a sleek and sexy machine. Now, of course, this one's got all the bodywork off of it. You can see it's got massive Brembo brakes here. It's got, uh, you know, it's front suspension. We've got covered up because we can't give our secrets away, right? You know, this is a championship leading team. You can't see what's on there, you know what I'm saying? And then uh, Nissan V8 for the power plant. To make it even better, I don't even know what kind of horsepower it makes. 400, 450, 220, 221, whatever it takes. I don't know, but it's a romp and stomp in V8. You would never expect the sound that this thing makes to come from a Nissan V8. It's pretty awesome. Beautiful car, simple design, cost capped category. Every manufacturer that can produce an LMP3 has got to sell them at a price point of 206,000 euro. I don't know what the exchange rate is today, so I can't tell you what that is in cash money, US dollars, but. Uh, it's a beautiful spec format. So the only differences come down to the tuning of the car and the performance of the drivers. Now for me this weekend, never having raced at Le Mans, this is gonna provide me with a really incredible opportunity to gain experience at this circuit. Cause I've actually lost out on some really, really great racing programs because I have never raced at Le Mans before. And given the uh, infrequent nature that anyone can compete on this circuit here at Circuit de la Sarthe, um, a driver with experience here is really, really valuable, and it's kind of the chicken or the egg scenario. If you don't get hired to race for the teams here at the 24-hour, you won't gain experience. But if you don't have experience, they're not going to hire you. Welcome to my world. I've had an entire career of sports car racing, and I had never still raced at this 24-hour, and uh, this is the first opportunity for me to race here. So I'm hoping for me personally, this will launch me to a point where next year I am now a candidate for a lot of these seats that I've missed out on in these past number of years. But all in all, I'm here to have a lot of fun and enjoy the experience. This event, if you've never been here, is remarkable. The amount of energy and enthusiasm is second to none. I have never seen anything like this. And I had the opportunity to walk part of the circuit yesterday and walk down the front straightaway. And I, I have to tell you, it's, <laughs> there is nothing like it. The, the feeling I had knowing that I was standing on the track surface where Audi and Porsche and all of these mega people and drivers and teams have uh, competed all of these years and made history, it's, it's really special. So it's a privilege for me to be racing here. Uh, in our second car over here, we've got Martin Brundle and Christian England. I mean, Martin Brundle is one of the most well-known racing drivers of our time. He's raced in Formula One. He's won the 24 hour of Le Mans. Christian England is his teammate, his silver ranked teammate, and Christian is leading the championship in the European Le Mans series right now. So we've got a super high quality team We've got great drivers, we've got really great looking cars, and uh, you got one happy guy right here. So I appreciate all of you guys tuning in. If you go to gt3lemanscup.com, you will be able to follow online all of the live timing from the sessions and some video streaming. Uh, as always, a shout out to our good friends at motorsport.com. They're gonna be doing incredible coverage of it, and uh, if you wanna 
follow the big race itself, of course, that's the place to get all of your information. But I'm loving life. I'm in Lamar. And at 8 o'clock tonight, I'm going to be wheeling this bad boy around Circuit de la Sarth. And that is a dream come true for me. We'll give you another update uh, after we qualify and let you know how it goes. Thanks for tuning in.